Ever since he made Down and Out in Beverly Hills, Richard Dreyfuss has been on a real roll. He had another hit with Tin Men, and now he's back with a movie called Stakeout, co-starring Emilio Estevez, and the two of them are cops who are assigned to stake out the apartment of a young woman who is the girlfriend of a dangerous escaped convict. She drives a 1980 Volkswagen, lives alone, long brown hair, brown eyes, 313 pounds. 313 pounds, let me see that. I imagine that's fully clothed. Oh my God, I thought she could be the house. This is disgusting. I hate this job. Watching her from across the street before long, Richard Dreyfus falls in love with the suspect and poses as a telephone repairman in order to get to know her better. Listen, uh, you think you could lend me a hat? A hat? Yeah, yeah, hat. I got this really bad skin condition and it's very dangerous for me to go out in the sun. Like a rash? Yeah, yeah, like a rash, it's, uh, it's, it's, uh, but it's worse. Oh, is this one of the things you don't want to tell me about? No, 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 it's nothing, really. It's nothing serious. I'm not sure it's your color. Seems perfectly fine. Much better. Thank you. I realize this is a low priority detail. Oh, I mean, can we talk, you know? Nobody's really going to care what I do. Bottom of the barrel. Right. But I would appreciate that you not act like a teenager in heat while we're working together. Okay? Stakeout is kind of an uneven movie. It begins with some real extreme violence in prison that doesn't seem to really prepare us for the fact that basically the whole middle part of this movie is a comedy, a comedy involving a love story starring Richard Dreyfuss and that suspect from across the street. Dreyfuss is very funny in the movie. The rest of the movie is not quite up to his level. I give Stakeout three stars, and I'm Roger Ebert.